Hey guys, we all love to customize our smartphone. So here I am presenting top 5 best launchers for a smartphone. Many of them you would be knowing. Do you know what? I think all of them you would be knowing. So wasting no more time, let's get right into it. So on number 5, we have launcher from Nokia called Z Launcher. It's a launcher which helps you to uh, find or open anything with the help of gestures. So for like you want to open settings, then you need to write settings with the help of gestures, which might take a lot of time. In home page, you are going to see things which are opened by you frequently, which is great. But this is the launcher which I like least in this list because you cannot customize the launcher. So you are pretty much stuck. Other than that, everything is absolutely fine with this launcher. It's fast, responsive and no signs of any lag, which is really important because most of the launcher go through it. Opening app drawer is nice, scrubbing through them, doing multitasking. I would not say that I have taken full advantage of this launcher. But yeah, the feature that I use most was taking advantage of frequently used list. So now let's jump into number four. On number four, we have launcher from Microsoft. Yeah, from Microsoft, the biggest enemy of Android after iOS. The launcher names Arrow Launcher. It's one of my favorite. One, because it's fully customizable. And secondly, it has one feature which makes you choose eight apps which you used often. And then that eight apps will be always present in the home screen, which is kind of a great thing, especially for me. And that's why this launcher is in the list. I have to say this, Microsoft has done a good job by making this launcher. It really works buttery. Next launcher in the list, I hope you all would be knowing, Go Launcher, which has now over 100 million downloads, which is kind of a crazy thing. But it doesn't make this launcher best of all. Definitely it has some flaws. You know what? Major flaws. Like when you are going to apply this launcher, you are going to feel like, like you have been spammed because in this launcher, there are a number of ads running all the time, which is the pain in the ass, I guess for all. Other than that, everything is okay, like animation is in top notch, wallpaper gallery is in top notch, customized logos of app looks absolutely amazing. So now let's jump into the next one, which is the best of all, greatest of all, Nova Launcher. I think this is the perfect launcher for everybody, especially for customizing your phone. You can change anything you want from going in Nova setting, like dock color, size of the dock, transparency level of dock, in which shape you want your dock to be displayed. Like I said, you can customize everything and make your phone looks like the way you want. I think we have to agree that developer had done a lot of hard work while making this launcher because it's perfect in every matter. But, but, everything is not again perfect in this launcher. The problem that I faced while using this launcher was going inside Nova setting. There are so much of options that made me confused. I'm not saying that adding more feature or icon girl option is bad, but it's like that that they have made so much of option that is really difficult to understand. Last but not the least, the launcher that I use, Google Now Launcher. This launcher is not in this list because I use this launcher. This launcher is in the list for its simplicity. I have used ton of launchers in my life, but I always stop at this. So the reason this launcher is number one for me, because it gives the user pure Google experience, which means you can take advantage of Google with this launcher. Like if you scrub from side, you will be treated with the news that you have chosen. You are also going to see the score of your favorite team. And another great thing about this launcher is that, that you can Google search anywhere you want. Um, does it really make any sense? Okay, let's leave it. And rest, as I say, the simplicity is the key. That is this launcher is loved by millions of people and yes, also by me. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching and all the names of the launcher are going to be listed down below. So it's going to be easy for you guys. And if you like this video, don't forget to smash that like button and make sure you subscribe to see more content like this. And again, I'm AJ signing off. Bye-bye.